To be COVID safe, all licensed venues are required to record the contact details of patrons and store them securely for 56 days. You must, for each patron, collect their full name, their email or their residential address, a phone number and their date and time of patronage. OLGR inspectors and the Queensland Police, when they're out and about doing our audits, are checking that your contact registers are up to scratch. Your patron's privacy is of course paramount and we've seen some really good examples of how businesses are making sure that they're protecting their patron's privacy through using technology such as QR codes and readers and apps. And the reason that we're asking you to keep these contact registers is all about effective contact tracing. In the event that somebody who is identified as COVID positive has visited your venue during the period that they were likely to be infectious, you can expect a call from Queensland Health contact tracers. They will be wanting to know, and very quickly, typically within an hour, the details of other patrons who were at the venue at the same time as a COVID positive person. Each person needs to be contacted by the contact tracers. It's an intense effort and it's very in-depth. They need to talk with all those individuals about where they have been and who else they might have been in contact with over the previous wee while. And it's a big web. So it starts here, but it moves out and out and out. So it's really important for the contact tracers that they have good, complete information from the get-go. Timing is absolutely imperative when they're doing their contact tracing tasks. And the quicker that they can trace the movements of those identified individuals, the quicker that they can get on top of any potential COVID cluster. By keeping your contact register fully and completely and up to date, you are not only showing that you care about your patron's uh, health and well-being, but you're doing your bit for the community. And you're also, importantly in my view, also assisting other businesses who we know um, have been struggling through the COVID shutdowns. The latest information on contact registers and tracing is available from Queensland Health's website.